we're back. We got a new topic for you guys. Something yes. happened in the golf world, which is pretty cool, exciting, new stuff. Uh, it's hyped. helping us connect some more dots as to some other stuff going on in the golf world. But yep. So what's happening is two of the biggest names in golf, arguably the two biggest names in golf, Tiger Woods and Rory McIlroy, are partnering up together to make a tech firm which will help further take sports into the tech field. And yes. I think the first venture that they're going to be going on is – in 2024, having a Monday night golf event that takes place in a stadium setting with a track man. Yep. And to my knowledge, it seems like they will bring in an artificial green into the middle so yep. that everyone in the stadium is able to like look down on the green and watch these guys putt. But they don't putt, obviously, until they're on the green via the track man. So you take your first two to three sh- uh, strokes on the simulator, probably watch it on a Jumbotron, and then I would assume your ball gets placed relative to where you landed it to the pin on the track, man, on the green, where you get to see. And I know that there's a lot of cool technology coming out now just in putting greens, uh, in a sense. Like, I know there's this one, uh, it's like a training aid they use a lot in colleges, like D1 programs and stuff. And it's this green where after you putt your ball, your ball leaves a tracer on the mat. So I would like to hope to think that maybe they'll incorporate that into this. We're going to be popping up pictures of what uh, they've showed us so far because this is also relatively super new. Right, kind of like a concept. It seems like a little concept in which they came up with. Um, It looks really – I don't know what stadium that is. It looks like Rocket League. Yeah, it definitely looks like Rocket League. Um, But this picture specifically gave me a little more insight and, like, made me a little more hype for it because when you were describing it, I couldn't really, like, picture what it – like what you were talking. You need about, to see you know the I mean? picture. You need yeah. to see the picture. So we'll be popping up a bunch of shit. Um, I, they they say they make it talk about they talk about it and make it seem like it's going to be in like a stadium setting. But yep. I feel like you you wouldn't be able to sell one of the ends of the arena. So like behind one of the goals in a hockey arena, you wouldn't be right. able to sell because it seems that's where the the main jumbotron screen for the track man would be. Right. And you obviously wouldn't want to sit behind that. No. Maybe um, it'd be like a concert where like just. At the stage, they don't sell behind the stage. That's you know, what like I'm a, thinking. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And if that's the case, it could actually end up being pretty, pretty cool. Yeah. And seriously. Uh, I don't know. I see in this in this photo, though, too, they show, like, bunkers and whatnot. Mm-hmm. And All the green there. I'm assuming those are not real bunkers because changing yeah. them to simulate the course would be pretty difficult. Hold the hole. Yeah, definitely. But maybe they... Uh, there's know. a green that gets like I, I don't we don't know too much. There's about a lot this. of things up in the air right yeah, now. Yeah, so sure. actually let's yeah. start with what we know. What we know is it's gonna be teams of three. It's gonna be Monday nights, and yep. I believe it's gonna be fourteen Monday night events. Yes, yeah, yeah. So that's cool. And uh, what I was getting to saying earlier about connecting the dots and whatnot, if anyone remembers, the two people who I'd say are the most butthurt about live golf, Rory and Tiger. Yep. Makes a little bit of sense now. Taking all these top name, top Big guys from PGA Tour, which Rory was probably planning on the past two years to have them play in his league. Yep. To now go to Greg Norman's league. Yep. It's pretty pissed. Oh, yeah. And, I mean, the PGA also can't be too happy about that because they're obviously losing guys, but then they're losing guys that potentially could be in this tomorrow sports league. Right. Which I don't, I, we I don't think know how big it's going to be. Are they directly sponsored with the PGA, though? It's I'm dir- sure. I think it's a, I think direct, it's a direct affiliation. Oh, PGA I see Tour a little Pros. PGA logo in this thing. Yeah, yeah, yep, yeah, yeah, it's, yeah. It's PGA Tour Pros, okay. I believe, are the ones who qualify to be in tomorrow. Right. Yeah, golf. it says six teams of three PGA Tour players. And, I mean, this, this could be really cool, though, too, if uh, just, like, incorporating some other golf stuff that we like. Yeah. Um, I'd love to see them do maybe like pro am events. That'd be oh, really yeah. really cool because I mean putting in the track man, in my opinion, is probably always going to be easier than regular golf. Yeah. So it'd be cool to see some like pro am events where maybe you get like a celebrity out there who golfs who's pretty good. Yeah. Maybe some pro athletes. Definitely. Uh, even just like golf personalities like Rick Shields. I'd love to tune in for like a Monday night event and it's like Garrett from Good Good with Rick oh, yeah. Shields posted Definitely. up playing against. Definitely. Tigers team, like that's there's just be That'd cool be stuff to see. Yeah, the one thing I did think about this is it's starting in January. It's on Monday nights. Is it gonna be the same time as Monday Night Football? But it's it's starting in January a year from. Oh, I'm sorry. This New Year's, right? So we have like a year and a half. But I would assume this is probably going to be a direct competitor to Monday Night Football. To Monday Night Football, because you're probably not. Or, I don't know. This is probably going to last a lot longer than Monday that's Night the, Football. That's the thing. You're right. There, there, but there will be an overlap, right? I mean, 
I would like to think that if they set this up properly, Monday Night Football starts at usually 8 o'clock, yeah. 8.30. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Start this shit at 6. Get yeah, it done so, by 8.30. Yeah, yeah, And yeah, then yeah, people exactly, will exactly. not move. Yeah. That's, that's the plan. Get home from work, watch this, yep. throw that on. For sure. I'm sure they'll figure that out. It's just kind of like I don't want to have to. I don't want to have to get a second TV for my living room. No way. No I don't want to do that. No way. But we will. We will if um, we have to. No, it's just, this just seems like a cool thing that they're doing to kind of... A, like you said, compete with Live Golf, but they definitely had this in the plans way I'm before. Just modernizing golf. golf. I mean, right. making it more appealing to younger generations. Like, we grew up golfing, so it wasn't really a problem for us. But I mean, like, just if you look at our friends, like the people yeah. who we've got golfing, and the people who have started golfing just because of good, good Rick Shields, and even, I mean, the PGA has been doing a lot better recently and just marketing sure. and everything. Yeah, for sure. And yeah, just, like, the, some of the personalities are cool, too. Like, Cameron yeah. Smith. Uh, yeah. PGA Memes is a good account that doesn't get enough credit. I'd yeah. say he does, like, home tours of pros. He's pretty close with a lot of the pros. Yeah. Like, those are sweet. I don't know. Yeah, I think that's really cool. But like you said, I think this is just another attempt to modernize golf, give it a little more, like, action. Like, or they're tr- at least that's what they're trying to do. Like, you see the people in this picture, they're like, yeah. Like, that's not really, like, a... Like, they're trying to, like, make it more of a stadium, exciting, yeah. like... And, like, I mean... More like a live golf type of thing. You it's know what I mean? so early it's to say. It's early. But there's one other thing I noticed, and I don't know if it's in this picture. Yeah. Um, it is. So, if you look, we'll put this picture up on the screen. Tiger Woods has an 85 heart rate, while Rory oh, has a yeah. 110. So, I was wondering if they wear heart rate monitors to kind of show, like, in those, like, situations where they're trying to keep their cool. There is no hiding it. You can't say, oh, I was calm and cool as a cucumber. Your heart rate was beating 115, buddy. You were (laughs) nervous. Like, that's pretty cool. That's pretty cool. Now, but the other question would be is, is that a health bar? We don't know anything. Like, is this, like, some kind of knockout golf thing where it's, like, you lose 30 points every time you lose a hole, and if you lose three holes, you're done? Yeah. Yeah. Like, there's a lot of cool things they could incorporate into this. And they can really do anything. It's they're, they're calling it tech-infused venues with tech-enabled fan and experience. What like, I think is also important, really this isn't supposed to just be golf. This isn't tomorrow golf. This is tomorrow sports. They're trying to take tech to sports, sports which is pretty general, cool. And they're just starting with golf. I personally That's think that like. out of every sport I can think of offhand, one of the sports that I think this could be the coolest was would be baseball. I think you could do For some sure. pretty cool hitting things. Sure. Definitely. Because... I don't know. It, you could do some pretty cool stuff with this for sure. Because you like that's a, they, with track man or swing man things. I think the the baseball one is swing man, but I used to use them all the time when I played baseball. You could on a big projector have it like you're hitting at Fenway Park, and you know you hit it over the green monster. It's awesome. You know what I mean? So that's another good point. And like yeah. maybe even if they were gonna do like something like this, they maybe even throw something out there where like I don't know, it's not on the TV. It's halftime type thing. Players are taking a break. Bring a couple fans down and have them hit some on the track, man, just yeah, to show definitely. that this shit's not easy. Like, it's exactly. not, like, rigged up so that this yeah. team's definitely winning. Right. But it'd be cool to see a couple guys go out there and hit some bad shots and just see those tracers go yeah, haywire. Exactly. Yeah, there's a lot of different things that they can do with it, and we I feel like we just kind of wanted to hop on right away. We heard about this yesterday and just share what we know and, you know, give our ideas of what, what we think they could do because there's, like you said, unlimited yeah. options. Future predictions, too. I would say I – uh this is such a different thing than anything we've seen. Yeah. It's kind of hard to judge, but it's almost makes it almost makes me think that Liv might last longer than this because Liv, Liv's format's uh, tried and true, you know? It's just the PGA, but a little bit tweaked. You know, yeah. This I, is like a, it's like a whole new sport, it seems it's, like. It's, so, it's, I mean. It's a whole new type of sp- What I think would be to, cool, yeah. too, is let's see where, let's see where Liv's at when this starts. For all we know, Liv could not be around anymore when this starts up. Liv could be the XFL, but the XFL is not signing Josh Allen, so I don't know. And, yeah, yeah, that's the other thing. But, I mean, thanks for tuning in to this, guys. (laughs) No, that's a good point. Like, no, you're right. We have no idea. Could you imagine all these guys go to live, right? All these guys go to live, and then something happens, and the money goes away, and they don't get And the PJs banned them? Like, right. Can't come back. Rory doesn't want to have anything to do with his tomorrow sports. And I guarantee you the players meeting that took place that was private and no media coverage, 80% of it was about this. Oh, yeah. yeah. The only thing I heard about that was that, like, Patrick Cantley maybe tried, like, taking control of the meeting. And then Tiger, like, walked in and, like, everybody literally said, shut up, like, quote, unquote, like, Patrick, stop <laughs> talking. Shut up. Tiger's here. Let Tiger talk. Like, That's awesome. And, I mean, it makes sense. He's running this shit. That's awesome. But he's a billionaire. All right. I mean, I think All the right. biggest question I have is just the greens. I want to know how they're going to be changing the greens hole to hole yeah, or definitely. if pin placement changes. And definitely. if that's the case, 
if this is an art, is it is it artificial grass? Like I need. There's a lot of questions I have. Putting on turf, like this is like all that, new. Everything right. about this is new. Isn't there that thing where the the contour of the greens, like it, like it's like yeah, a green that, that's where what I'm talking about. Like, like that, that one that yeah, traces. Yeah, yeah. You, there's yeah. a remote that comes with it, and think about like the bed where you can like make it harder or softer. It works like that, but it'll yeah. like change the contour of the green. Right. So it's like, oh yeah, we could do that, but you can't change the shape of it. Can't change the bunker location. Yeah. I don't know. It's going to be interesting. It's going to be sweet, though. This picture really ties everything together. Yeah. For me, anyway. It's almost like they could, like, do it outside, and it might be easier. <laughs> Literally, yeah. Literally. Yeah. I don't know. It'll be cool, though. It'll be really cool. It'll be cool. I'm excited. Um, it's I'm more prepared. golf, more shit to watch. More I was going to say, we're, uh, it's just another development in the story of, you know, the golf world being divided between live and PGA, and now there's this tomorrow, and I don't know, man. It's going to be cool. It's cool. It's cool as fuck, so. Yeah, that's all I got. That's all Golf, you got. Golf's turning into the MMA with all these promotions, man. I know. I'm I liking know. it, though. It's, it's cool. cool. It's but cool. Thanks yep. for tuning into this uh, short update on what we know in the golf world. And yeah, I really appreciate it, though. Thank we'll get you back to you guys soon with more info as it comes out. Absolutely. Could all be right. a while, though. We'll Could see. be a while, yeah. But uh, as soon as we hear something, we'll hop on here and do something real quick. So sure. absolutely. All right, guys. Thank you again. Peace out. Peace out.